Let's go 50-50. Those are words that are an automatic death knell to any potential relationship. And women need to take heed to that. Hi, this is Janelle, the relationship coach behind the Successful Invisible. I have the privilege of working with wonderful, educated, professional ladies who are 35 plus and are looking to just make their better decisions in dating and date with more intentionality. So 50-50 is a scam. And this conversation has come up the past couple years through a lot of red pill, uh, men's right activists, rhetoric, and all that jazz. It is a scam, okay, because it does not exist in real relationships. So what do I mean by that? When a man says 50-50, he is talking strictly about money. And that is actually not a good thing because you need to look at all of the factors at play before you would even engage in this conversation. And that should not be the way it's presented. Number one, the men who want to go 50-50 are usually out earning the woman, okay? So him putting, let's say bills, 50% of bills, um, let's use rent for an example. Say the two people are renting a place, uh, this couple, and the rent is $2,400 a month, and he's screaming 50-50. He expects her to put up $1,200 a month, and he's putting up $1,200 a month, right? 50% each. That is a scam if she's making 50000 and he's making $150,000 a year. The impact to their budget is different. It's intentionally going to harm her and allow him to save money. If you want to have fairness in relationships, first of all, you need to understand all the factors and you need to look at equity. The financial impact to her, the one making $50,000 a year, needs to be the same as the financial impact to him who is making $150,000 a year. So you need to look at equity and you need to look at percentages. Do not get conned by 50-50 because the men who say it are intentionally being manipulative. They are intentionally seeing how they can put in less and get less themselves and then get a lot more from their partner to free up their resources to probably be selfish at a minimum, but probably cheat. So this is from what I've seen personally in my coaching practice, as well as with peers and friends through the years. 50-50 is a scam. If you want an equitable relationship, that can be had, but the two parties need to sit down and really hash things out. Also, this is why 50-50 is a scam. The men who say that are only, like I said, talking about money. They're not talking about the amount of household labor this is if kids are involved or not. That goes into the household. He still wants to exempt himself from all of that. So she's still putting in more. That is why it is a con and a scam. Any man that says that is not saying it in good faith. He is a bad actor. That is a major red flag. So ladies, pay attention. 50-50 is a scam. Equity is very different than 50% of a number that each person is contributing. If he does not want to have a serious conversation about that, so how chores, responsibilities, um, financial obligations, etc., can be split in a way that they have equitable impact on both parties, he's very insincere. He's trying to scam you. He's trying to use money. You're, he's trying to use your money and save as much as his as possible because he sees you as a stepping t stone so he can use that money he's saving to go out and do the things he wants to do. Usually it is dating other women. So 50-50 is a scam. Completely block any man who says that because he's saying that as a bad character in bad faith and he's trying to manipulate you and spend as much of your money as possible.